Would you believe me if I said I only paid 19 cents for all this stuff? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So you saw everything I got and I really did only pay 19 cents. That is amazing, that is epic because it included soda. Like how amazing is that? Three of these for 19 cents, amazing. And then everything else is free in my mind. That's how I picture it. But really 19 cents, everything is free. But let me tell you what I did. Um, so if you've been watching me for a while, you know that on Mondays, I typically use my mom's card. Tuesday, if I have good deals, I'll use my card. My card has nothing again. So my mom's card was just epic this week. So she had a 12 off of 60 that printed on the receipt last week. And then she had a spend 50, get a $10 extra buck loaded to her account. That's free, what I say, 12, 12 plus 10, blah, 12 plus 10, $22, free $22. Like that's amazing. My card had absolutely nothing. The only thing I can do is um, free Kotex, which I doubt I'll go there just for that because I have so much of that, but maybe I will because I think it's like a dollar money maker for me. And I'll show you how I did that on this account. Um, but it, I could not pass up today's deals. So um, first, let me show you what I did. Um, I did do the Kotex, I'll show you that first. Well, the soda was three for 10, okay? There's no extra buck attached to it. Three for 10. It was on my grocery list to get anyway. And three for 10 is an okay deal. Um, at a regular grocery store, I can maybe get four for 12, but um, it's an okay deal. But with those um, three for, so it was three for 10, but I spend 50, get 10. So that made them free, really, if you think about it that way. So I did the Kotex deal. I hope I'm in the frame. Sorry guys, my head was just cut off. I kind of have to sit far back and I'm hoping you guys like this background a little bit better than my car. It's just a little bit different. Um, and I went, so I went to my first CVS today. The red box machine was down and that's the one on my way to pick up my son from daycare. So my option was, cause I needed some CRTs that I didn't already send to the card. Um, and this is my mom's account. So my app on my phone is my account and I can, can never log in and get into her account for some reason on my phone. So I picked the baby up and I passed another CVS from daycare to my house and I went there with him, which can always be a disaster when you're with a kid, but he was great. So it kind of worked out well. Um, I did have one hiccup, which I'll explain later, but these guys here are, let's see, the 10 count, 16 count of liners. In my store, they're $1.79, buy one, get one 50. So $1.79 and 89 cents. I had a $2 off Kotex CRT and I had a two off two tampon CRT. Um, the two off two came off with no problem. The two off you by Kotex adjusted down to seven cents. Now total, they should have been 269. So it shouldn't, yeah. So I think it sounds like it took off just enough to make these $0 and I got a dollar back. So that's a dollar money maker. Um, some of these things adjusted kind of weird and I don't know why, but like I said, I only paid 19 cents, so I'm not complaining. Um, next deal I did is the Glucerna. I've never bought these before. I won't try them. I'm not a, I don't like peanuts. I don't like peanuts and I don't like caramel, but my husband, I'm hoping will eat those. So they're actually a lot smaller than I thought they would be. I don't know if you can tell, but they're not big boxes and there's six bars in there. These were $5.69 each, um, which makes them $11.38. I had a five off two in the $7.21 smart source, so I paid $6.38 and I got back $5. So it's $1.38 for two. So it's not too bad, but I had all those other coupons, so definitely worth it for that. Here's where my hiccup went, is my diapers. Why, why, why do CRTs not wanna scan sometimes? I think I know why, and I'll explain it. But these were two for 20. I used a three off two in this past Sunday's PNG, and then a three off 20 diaper CRT. That did not want to scan, but let's pretend it did. I would have paid 14, get back five, which makes it $9 for two or $4.50 each. But remember, I had that 12 off of 60, so that pretty much pays for these. Um, so, I think what's been happening, if you've been watching my videos, is none of my CRTs are working if they are purchase-based because I used that 12 off of 60 CRT 
So I just don't think the three off of 20 want it to work because I already use a purchase based CRT. You watch all my other videos when I say things went wrong, that's probably why because I'm using these purchase based CRTs. So this time I did plan ahead and I tried not to use any, but the one time one went through perfectly fine. So I don't know. Anyway, he, the guy, um, my cashier was awesome. He said, for some reason this isn't working. Um, I'll just price adjust for you so you get the, the $3 off. So he went ahead and did that. And then I didn't even think about it. My receipt printed and I didn't get my $5 extra buck because he price adjusted because you have to spend 20 to get the five. So um, I was already walking to my car and I noticed that I walked right back in and they no problem printed me an extra buck for $5. So it wasn't an issue, but thank God I saw it. Cause if you're not paying attention, you'll miss it. And then if you go back another time and it's a different person, they might not do it for you. So always, always, always check your receipt. So anyway, they would have been $9 or more $9 without my um, extra stuff. Next, I got a little freebie here. It's the Frizzies Hairspray. Um, it was marked for $2.79 or $2.89. I had a $3 CRT for any John Frieda, that is John Frieda, um, hair care. So this should have just been a freebie. Um, it was a freebie, but for some reason when I on my receipt it says it was $2.99 but my CRT was for $3 so that worked just fine and it actually did not price adjust so that was kind of weird to me so it took the full $3 off so that extra penny or whatever it should have adjusted down it didn't I'm not gonna complain about that this one price this one did get messed up so this is my Revlon kiss bomb now Revlon has a deal I didn't do the deal but you have to spend 10 get four I only got this this was $4.99, and I had a $4 CRT that printed last week at the Red Box. I believe everybody got that. That was a mystery coupon, so this was $0.99. Cents. Um, so now I have $4.99 tracking. I only need to spend $5.01 to get $4. So technically, I could go back and get something for $1.01. So I have to spend $5.01, get $4 back. Um, I could probably just do this again, really, because the 98% rule... I could get this for a dollar but I don't know that I'll do it just because I don't know I don't feel like it and coupons don't apply to the kiss bomb usually and I don't even know if there are any coupons I forgot to check and then my last deal I did is the Maybelline <clears throat> so I had um, I didn't use the Maybelline mystery coupon from last week on this account I did it on my account but I still had it for this account so the blush was $5.99. There's a $2 off any face product in the 8.4 with Retail Me Not. And then the mascara was $7.79. And there was a $2 mascara coupon also in the 8.4 Retail Me Not. So that was $13.78. And I had a $3 CRT. I had $4 in coupons. So that took off $7. I paid $6.78 and got back $5. So $1.78 for both of these. But again, with everything combined, it was it all worked out wonderfully. Now, my Revlon Kiss Bomb CRT price adjusted to $3.86. It was $4.99. It was a $4 CRT. It shouldn't have done that, but it did. And then I told you my Kotex CRT price adjusted. Yeah, it only it, I I made a mistake earlier. Price adjusted to seven cents, so it should have taken more off, and it didn't. So I paid a little bit extra, but I still got a dollar back. So on the Kotex. I don't know what happened, but my math was a little bit off because of things price adjusting. I thought I was going to pay 26, no, $27 and some change. I gave them $26 and extra bucks. My subtotal was $3.09. So because of things price adjusting, I had paid a little bit more than I was supposed to. It's okay. I paid, so my total after tax was $3.19. I used a gift card that had $2.24 left on it, so then I owed $0.95. Cents. So that's all I paid out of pocket was $0.95. Cents. And then I got back, hold on, I have wrote it all down so I wouldn't forget where did I write it. So I used 29 so after extra bucks and out of pocket, I paid $29.19 and I got back $19 in extra bucks. So $0.19 cents for all of that. Even though things went wrong, they always do for me at CVS if you haven't noticed that pattern. Something always goes wrong, but it worked out in my favor. I paid $0.19 cents and I got soda, like something on my grocery list. I'm so excited solely about the soda. And of course diapers, I always need diapers. Everything else, 
I didn't want or need, but I did it to make everything free. I got try to get the best deals, the cheapest deals to make this worth it for my family. So Diet Pepsi, I drink one of these every day. So does my husband. And of course we use the diapers. So that is amazing. Um, I hope you guys got the same um, benefits, the CRTs that I did, the 12 off of 60 and the spend 50 get 10 because if you did you can do the same deals and um i got another eight off 60 for next week on my mom's account so i should have another awesome week next week um but i don't know what the deals are i haven't even checked yet so hopefully that'll be great um but i'm not going to do a tuesday cvs video uh, like i said there's nothing on my card worth doing except the Kotex deal. Sorry, that one just covered the camera. This is the only thing that I got. That this is the only CRT I got that made anything worth it. So, um, without those other CRTs, it's not money maker for anything, and it's not worth paying nine dollars for diapers. It's way too much. Um, so that's gonna be all for me this week from CVS. But stay tuned this week for an epic Walmart. I bought a haul. I might be hitting Target. I hit Giant and did a couple rebates there. But I have two huge bonuses that I plan on hitting this week. So keep an eye out for that um, towards the end of the week. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And don't forget to subscribe if you not um, if you're not already. And I'll see you later. Bye.